is so crazy. But like, imagine a German Eminem. I would love to see that. Bro, I would love to see how to ask as that. somebody. Oh, yeah. So, well, yeah. Who, yeah. Who I'm, 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 I'm educating him. I'm educating him when it comes to that. Bro, I'm very late '90s hip hop. I'm really like I can't tell you. If you if you tell me about like what who's cool who, with me, bro. You're like, you're cool. You're cool. Bro. Who is it nowadays? Like little Uzi and the baby and the NBA. Y'all need to leave my Uzi and, like, alone. I have no idea. I have no idea who that like. I, I said Uzi. I just what he is. Bro, I don't know. I don't Dr. Dre. I know Snoop Dogg. I know Tupac. I like, like most kind of people. Yeah. I know Nate Dogg. I love Nate Dogg. Like you know those guys. 213 and those guys. Like, I love yeah, that stuff. Yeah, yeah. That's my stuff. Okay, okay. Hey, yeah. Like, I'm a California guy. <laughs> That's my stuff, you know? You cool, man. And like, <laughs> you all right, man. You know that? Brother, you know, <laughs> just, I'm not sure if that's a popular opinion, but to me, um, the first two Eminem um, albums, which was uh, Slim Shady LP yeah, and Marshall uh, Mathers, Marshall, to me, best hip-hop albums ever, in my opinion. Mm -hmm. And I'll tell you why. Mm -hmm. And I'll tell you why. Mm -hmm. As a wrestler, Eminem was a guy who had an actual gimmick. Slim Shady, the darkest of the dark. Like every yeah. human being has weird thoughts, but he would never express, he would never say. But Slim Shady is that little 0.1% of the human being that is so dark and so bad, you know, that he would actually say it. Like, I love that. I, I think that was awesome. Adapted to so how'd you guys, how'd you guys adapt? Like being from, you know, being from different countries. Like what's the first time you heard like different music or like did you guys, were you guys like younger and then you see like Eminem on TV and Dr. Dre and 50 Cent, and then he's like, yo, who are these guys? And they're speaking a different language. Especially with the language barrier, because right. you know multiple languages. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Well, well, how many like, languages do you know? You know? Three. Three? Okay. Uh, German, Italian, and English. But, like, with us, for example, or where I lived, like, it's just tiny mountain village somewhere up there. So we still had, like, the top charts or whatever. So we would still get music from the States and, and so. So we knew, like, the, the really big tracks. But I, like, he totally introduced me to 90s rap, and I love it. Like, Big yeah. E and Tupac and... That's, that's, awesome, a, that's yeah. a heavyweight class. Yeah, that's, that's yeah. Like, it's like, he's funny though. He's the type of guy. He, he, does, he does cardio, and yeah. then he learns like each and every word of the lyrics. Yeah, yeah. I don't want to yeah. put him on the spot right now, but he has like a couple oh, of man. Big no. songs down. I'm just saying, like he could. Uh, somebody give him beat. You did him right, bro. <laughs> oh man, yeah, you fed him chicken soup for the soul. So. <laughs> <laughs> like spoon fed. That yeah, one. but hey, like, but Germany's highly, um, um, uh, how do you say? influenced by American music. Yeah. Basically, totally. I would say yeah, like yeah, it ten, is. until 10 years ago, 99% was American music. Yeah. The biggest wow. stars were if like, you, you got know, the big hits here, you, you totally know about it in Europe, for you know, sure. Like, wow. you'll hear them all, all over, them. Definitely, definitely, yeah.